Hey guys, welcome back to part two of Let's Play Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. And, actually it was almost the full 11 minutes last time, so I probably should have stopped when I rescued Zelda, but we're going to find the secret passage that she talks about, and we're going to leave. Simple as that. And we're just going to go this way, because we can. Hey look, the guards can't touch us. Oh crap. Okay. I love how everything, like, halts when you go upstairs. It's just so odd. Alright, so, let's go this way now. You mean we're gonna take the princess out in broad daylight with these guys around? Wow, there's three of them down there. That's kind of scary. Glad I did come this way, then. And, apparently, it's not gonna let me through there, so... That's right, use the woman as a meat shield, Link. Don't be afraid. Alright, so we're back down to... Let's see. It says, secret passage. Old man, okay. So, secret passage is going to take us to an old man. I don't like the sounds of this already. <clears throat> Okay, we're going to ignore you guys, because you can't climb stairs. I don't understand it, but... What? Ornamental shelf? That looks like a... You know what? I'm not going to argue. I'm not. I have a light, and she says it's pitch dark, so push it from the left. Is she actually helping, or is she just being in the way? That's what I want to know. Bad woman, get back in the kitchen. Oh... All right, now that it is dark, we actually are going to bring the lamp out. Of course, you know, you can see without having the lamp actually out, but it makes this part easier. Oh, look, rats. And we get more magic? Come here, rat. Yeah, the lanterns don't stay lit. They will quit. So, and that was a rhyme by accident. And that didn't light. There's a light up here. See, another cool thing is you can actually light all of them, and it looks like there's no darkness at all. But then again, you know, you have that nice little time limit that says, oh, hey, you ran out of lantern, so it's dark again. And I don't think that sentence even made sense. But my god, that's a lot of snakes. These snakes are called ropes, by the way. If I'm remembering that these are the right ones. And they were in the original Legend of Zelda. And I don't even know why that's necessary to light both of those. So apparently, we're underneath the castle. Ow! Quit, the, quit that! A heart, yay. Hey! Keeps you on your toes down here with no. Okay, just stop and then let me run into you. That's that's lovely. And I believe those bats are called keys, but they may have changed all the enemy names in the Zelda. I don't know. I don't care. But we have a key to open that door. That was really really difficult. Oh, so now we're in the sewers of the Hyrule Castle. That's absolutely enlightening. Hey, red ruby. Yeah, the rupees in this game, they have differing values. Green rupees give you one. A red rupee will give you, I believe, 20, and a blue one will give you five, so. Now, I love the little death animation when you kill something. It turns into that little, like... Almost like a skull cloud, and then they just disappear. See? Uh-oh. See, watch. It's really neat. I've always liked that little touch. But we need a light. A light. Yeah. I don't know what to call it. A light, a lamp, a solar ray. Who cares? 
Yeah, let's just tread in the water and get uh, Zelda all nasty in the sewer. Ew. And obviously, this one continues from the other room as far as the lamps go, so... And with that, we have a key to use on this door. Isn't that difficult? So incredibly hard to figure this, this key system out. Now, you can come back in here later if you have bombs or um, the... I can't remember what they're called. But uh, Pegasus Shoes, I believe been a long time since I have played this game, so. But anyways, you can actually charge into it or bomb it, and it'll blow those walls open. We're getting uh, quite a few rupees here. I'm gonna die here, aren't I? That's gonna be embarrassing. Little things are so fast. Sanctuary! Oh, and uh, for all intents and purposes, if you pull the right one, it does open the door. But if you pull the left one, I'm probably going to regret doing this. Yep, I thought so. Rope! Everywhere! And we got absolutely nothing out of it but a single rupee. No hearts, nothing. Make that chime shut up. Oh my god. Oh, Princess Zelda, you're safe. Is this your doing? It's a creepy old man. So, uh, let's see. Wizard, captive. The seal open when I'm done with you. And, yeah, we can't let uh, Aganim, Aganim, I don't know. But apparently he wants to destroy Hyrule, so. Hmm. Um, powerful evil force that guides Aganim, Aganim, and augments his power. Hmm. So now we need to go get the Master Sword. Okay. Alright, so we need to go find this Elder. Yes, we understand. I don't want to have to talk to that all over again. Okay. Well, Heart container. All right. I wish we could dash. That would make this so much quicker. All right, so let's get over to Kakariko Village, I believe is what it's called. And, of course, the guards are going to be pissed at us now, so they're just going to charge us on sight. Not like they can really do much. I mean, they are kind of brainless, and they wear armor that keeps them from climbing steps. I mean, what kind of mobile force unit are they? Yep, Kakariko Village. You know what? Let's take the sign with us. Oh, and it broke. Ah, haha, <laughs> you killed yourself. Yay, a heart. Yeah, if you're low on health, go cut bushes and stuff. You can actually replenish your health that way. And we can't pick these up yet, so we can try all we want, but they don't do anything. Hey, a chicken. What's in here? Fortune telling, hmm? Why not? Looks like the old wither robes. You will find the elder Sahasrala. 20 rupees? You're a fucking ripoff. Congratulations. That is the first F word in any of my LPs. And it was done and provoked by a fortune teller. I see Elder. Uh, nobody's seen him. Okay. All right, let's see. We've got story. The prosperous people known as the Hylia inhabited this land. Legends tell of many treasures that the Hylia hid throughout the land. The Master Sword, a mighty blade forged against those with evil hearts, 
is one of them. People say that now it is sleeping deep in the forest. Do you understand the legend? Yes. Alright, so, in the next part, we will continue looking for the Elder. And, uh, smash some pots before we do. So, in the next video, we'll, we'll go find the Elder. Until then, I'm Ultima Mantoid with Let's Play Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. Till next time.